Are you excited for Bangkok? Onik, first time jatchi. Tomar kya hosta? Hello. Visa paisi? Na ekono visa paisi. Are you done with your visa? Oh, hey guys, how are you doing? What are you guys up to today? Well, just hanging out. What about you? Well, I'm doing pretty good. Well, actually, I'm actually doing really, really great. But, oh. but before I tell you why, why don't you tell me a little bit about your experience in Oslo and in, uh, and in Bangkok? Ah, it was a great experience there. Working with so many brilliant minds from across the world and great mentors. Of course, it was a lifetime opportunity. Uh, so basically, we were working on four projects there: a safe internet, digital identity, and big data for social good, and the working decent working conditions. And that was a project you were working on, right? Yes. Yeah. Uh, additionally, we were invited to the Nobel Peace Prize award ceremony. We also attended the Nobel Peace Torchlight Parade and the Nobel Peace Concert. That was pretty cool, especially seeing John Legend during the ceremony sing Redemption Song. That was really emotional. Yes, it I was. loved it. But, uh, so, but you guys are working on specific projects now, so tell me a little bit about yours. So basically we are working on big data for social good. So we started at work Oslo, where we started is that we wanted to make people aware or educated about the trending topic big data. Now we are narrowing it down. What we are doing is we are trying to solve malaria through big data by involving social workers, medical workers and all the people in it. That's a really interesting project because malaria is one of the major health problems and those kinds of vector-borne diseases are a real... Targeted. That's very cool. Yeah. And you're working on the same team that I'm mentoring. Yes. Tell me a little bit about how you feel about that. What's going on there? Um, we are a team of six uh, from six different countries. We recognize that workers around the world have been subjected to degrading working conditions. So we're building a solution that gives workers the agency by reporting their working conditions. Additionally, we are also organizing an exhibition in Bangkok this May in collaboration with the Nobel Peace Center. This is really exciting because now, you know, I've had this opportunity to see a dozen or two, two dozen in fact, uh, people come together, people who are young people from countries around the world to work on big, big, big problems. And it's really kind of humbling to see the kind of creativity and drive that goes beyond that or into that. Uh, and now is the next step and it's a kind of the We Start Change exhibition and show. And that's going to be designed to allow people to understand the challenges that we've taken on as a uh, as a group so i think you should stay tuned that's going to be a really really interesting exercise coming up in bangkok in a few weeks yeah very excited well, well that, that's actually absolutely brilliant there's nothing really much more exciting than seeing all these active minds coming together to try and solve important world problems now 2017 we're almost done and I want to congratulate the winners for 2017 and I hope you get an opportunity to continue the work that you're doing to change the world, make it a better place. But this program is designed by Telenor Group, the Nobel Peace Center and Grameen Phone and our, our objective in this program is to attack big, big issues using the power of digitization and our networks. So we're now going to start 2018, and as of now, Telenor Youth Forum 2018 is open for applications. We look forward to seeing you come forward, bring us your best ideas, bring us your best minds, bring us your best intentions and hard work, and let's see if we can do something interesting to change the world.